So earlier this month, we uh, asked you to nominate someone in your life who was making a difference in the community for our Holiday Heroes campaign. Yeah, we received hundreds of entries, and today we're happy to announce the grand finalist. It is Michael Mathis from Everett, and I was able to be there for the big reveal. We are here at the Q13 studios for a really special surprise. We've got Michael Mathis, who is a holiday hero in our community. Michael Mathis, Mr. Wiki. Hey, nice to meet you. Any minute now, we're going to have our, our interview. He has no idea that this surprise is about to happen. Luke Wilson of Seattle Seahawks is on his way. Awesome. That was awesome. <laughs> uh, I nominated Michael uh, mainly for everything that he's done for children over 30 plus years. Even before the foundation was started, he was in the hospitals working with the kids and telling the kids it's gonna be all right, you're still gonna have a life, you're still gonna be able to do things. Having the support from Q13 and the support from the Seahawks is absolutely awesome. I'm really excited to see his face when he comes through that door. And it's gonna be exciting. I'm uh, at the big green box, so I get the honor of giving Mike the gift. I just want, I want these kids to change the world. Yeah. I said, you guys can affect the world if you get out there. If you sit behind doors, you'll never affect anybody. Because that's a hard thing to drive the kids to, is stop being so self-absorbed. I, <clears> like, <throat> I feel like your advice is probably good for every kid to oh. hear. These are life lessons, yeah, you know? Yeah, yeah. So um, I have to stop you yeah. um, because there is a real reason we brought you here. <laughs> and I'm going to cry. <laughs> We asked people on air, we've asked people to nominate someone for a holiday hero. Jeremy, what are you doing here? <laughs> I don't know. I got lost. Hey, buddy. I like, can't even get it out. How are you? Okay. <laughs> so, um, Michael, you have been chosen as our Q13 Fox holiday hero, and you were nominated here by your friend Jeremy. Yeah, you fine. <laughs> so this whole thing. I don't like that. I, I know, but while I've loved talking to you, we wanted to honor you because you have just done so many amazing things for the community, for kids in need. You're gonna get it. <laughs> <laughs> you are. You're gonna get it. So I'm sure you're you a Seahawks through, fan. I know you're gonna have to go through uh, Seattle Seahawks. Luke Wilson here. First and foremost, I just want to say that your work through the Burn Children Recovery Foundation is truly amazing and it's been an inspiration to a lot of people so thank you for that and as you can see I come bearing gifts <laughs> um, there's a few little things in here but the uh, main gift is a, a VIP trip for four come down to Dallas on Christmas Eve and, and watch us beat the Cowboys <laughs> so uh, Merry Christmas and thank yeah. you for everything you do thank you thank you so much no that's thank you that, man. that's really cool So a really great story there. Now, unfortunately, uh, a few days after the big surprise, uh, Michael and his family had some last minute commitments uh, and, and uh, they figured out that they could not take that trip to Dallas. Uh, Q13 Fox then made a donation to Michael's foundation. Uh, so glad we could do that. And luckily we had a first runner up who oh. was equally deserving and able to go on the trip. So there Very you go. Very nice. Um, James Bivy of Port Orchard, uh, the president and uh, of the National Alliance to End Suicide, helping countless veterans uh, contemplating taking their own lives or even facing homelessness. Uh, James was nominated by his wife, Michelle, and they are taking their two kids on the trip to Dallas on Sunday. We'll oh, hear his story wow. after 9 a.m. Yeah. Wow. Well, it's 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 too bad that they couldn't make the trip. But I mean, yeah. we we got to you know d double the pleasure and and uh, you know kind of a win win there. You know, the one positive was um, that Michael kept talking about his organization that sends kids to this important burn camp, and um, he was saying, you know, I don't want this to be about me. I want it to be about the kids. So the good news is that we can make that donation uh, to the burn camp that he, uh, he you know his foundation does. So I think that is going to be something that Michael really wants for the holidays, just to support those. Kids kids at that burn camp. What an awesome yeah. blessing all the way around. Very cool.